Pits. I'm going to let Pitts shoot all the shovels. Hey, yeah, I just don't want you to come out of there empty handed. You know what I mean? Just point and say shoot that. Uh, just, anybody just, have just, any uh, face paint? What we got going on here? We got a stuck four wheel. <laughs> you got any ideas on it? Can we just try to push it or? Try to push it. It's it stuck off to the side all the time. It keeps drifting this way. Yeah. See, so it pushes down that way. Fields of Louisiana, where it's wet and very muddy. We had a little bit of difficulties getting in because the mud gets a little thick. You know, it's one of these places where you walk in, you might be six foot, and when you walk out, you're about six eight. So that's what we're dealing with this morning: heavy boots, thick mud. And uh, right now, I'm trying to take off a jacket because it gets pretty warm in this stuff. But anyway. We're going to see what happens. Decoys were set up for us already, so we didn't have to put that in. So, birds are already flying, it's already shooting light, and then uh, hopefully we'll get a few work in this morning. And of course, we got our real tree family here today too, so we got quite a few guys here. So it's, it's always a pleasure to spend time with these guys and uh, catch up from last season and the beginning of their season. So I hadn't seen some of them in a while, so it's a great opportunity to catch up on some good stories. So anyways, we'll have a good time this morning regardless. And I think I just grabbed three and a half. Okay. I don't know if this gun will change. Yeah, I guess we'll find out. What's going on with this gun? All we got is the three and a half inch shells, but we ain't got three and a half inch guns. So, I think this one is. Hey, uh. <laughs> I can't read if this one will, right here will chamber a three and a half. Hey, what I like to do, yeah. you right handed? Yeah. Put the gun right here like cross. When you lift up, it's, yeah. So when you raise up, it's right there. You know what I mean? Oh, what we 
got. We got us a green right there, buddy. Hey, right. hey, hey, hey. It's my first ever green. Is it really? I think so. There's a group of, what the heck is that? I'm pretty sure that's the first mallard I've ever killed right there. Well. Of course, I've never killed a handful of ducks in my whole life, so. That's like shooting a 180. Oh, really? Yeah. I'll be dying. That's good. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. That's a 180, 190 right there. <laughs> he's pretty mature, too. You know what I mean? Did, did you check his teeth? Yeah. He, yeah. <laughs> Make he's, sure. good, he's a good two, three-year-old. Yeah, that's good. Look at him How long does a duck live? Do you know the life expectancy on one of those? Man, if I had to guess, I think the average is like three years. Three years on yeah, one? Yeah, but they've had birds banded. I think uh -huh. some, some of the bands they recovered showed them to be 20 years old. Wow. So, but I think the average. These ducks locked up. Gunslinger, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Hey, you're a true gunslinger right there now. I love it. Throw it at him. Isn't that the filet mignon of the sky there, mm -hmm. Good boy. That's a good bar belly, too. Yeah. Hey, come on. topped off this morning. We got old Michael Pitts over here. He got his first mallard this morning, so it was a great success. We ended up about a half a dozen birds and a few geese. And actually made some great retrieves today. So actually this morning was a great success. It was fun hanging out with our friends and uh, looking forward to spending this afternoon with them and getting back after it in the morning. Hey, what else you I'm get? pretty much a duck expert. Hey, now. yeah. Hey, now what else Hey, you I, I got a bar bevel, belly, bar belly. Stay. Yeah, a bar belly. He got him a bar belly. He y'all entertained, didn't he? He's a bar belly. Yeah. What y'all get? Oh, we got ten. Yeah, a dozen or so. We'll get three or four geese. It was okay. Oh yeah. Oh, that's fun. I killed two. After we got gar holes, you know, the wind was blowing down the road. Yeah. South, straight south. Yeah. We had no wind at daylight though yeah. for a while. We didn't have any. Did y'all show me those? Hey, that's a good trick though. I want to learn that though. Give somebody a. A gun that shoots three inch and give him three and a half shells. Hey, hey that was a perfect three setup. Three and a half on that table. He grabbed the three and a half. I, I just grabbed the case. Hey, he wanted the candlestick. The case. He wanted to shoot the candlestick. I'm blaming that on the hunter. Uh, hey, I'll take the blame take all day long. Uh, I'll take it. It was a good time, though. So y'all didn't out. finish with a limit. I put that first one in there and it went and, and, and top So you didn't shoot said, it all, didn't you? No, I didn't have a This gun. ain't a three and a half gun. That's why y'all didn't kill the limit. Had Could my, you have killed 18? Oh, yeah. We only had one gun that went boom. No, we had two, two. guns go boom. Yeah. Right? You killed some? Yeah. Y'all get any, any, what, any teal coming in? Yeah, green wing. Yeah. We got one blue wing. My little mixed bag. Yeah, we, it was, it, hey, it was a Louisiana special. That's it right there. Louisiana. <laughs> some of them do all right. What some of them yeah, get we, as close we, as they we, could. Yeah. With yeah. yeah. They, they scared, you know, they, oh, wanted, I know. Yeah, they wanted to go down that corner. We turned a few of them around, worked back in, and, of course, they stayed right outside was, the decoys. I was telling him how to do it all the whole time. The eagle eye over here, man. He I was, was telling him the whole time. Those hey, man, he was pulling them down. I was proud of him. He was, it was no I wouldn't shame let him in commit. his game about throwing I was steel. flinging lead. Yeah, he was singing lead. lead. Steel. Hey, it ain't my fault they don't want to come all the way in. <laughs> you were made sure they yeah, do it. Yeah, real trip all the I'm yeah. shooting <laughs> <laughs> That's what he's saying, too. <laughs> I was going to make sure they didn't come back. Then it's got me in the 150 section. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they make a daggum good call too. They, they do? Yeah. Echo? Yeah. Uh, I want your recommendation for a beginner that don't know nothing about it. You just want to, you want to just learn right yeah. now? Well, I mean, I uh, want to get something good in case, you know, I, well, I don't want to be in the $12 section. Uh, in case you really take off with this duck hunting thing. 
I, I, I am in a minute. I'm, I'm about to go crazy and start making it rain on the duck count. Okay, there's double reed and single reed. Okay. Single reed's a little bit harder to blow. Okay. Double reed's a little bit easier to blow uh -huh. and easier to learn from. Okay. And then once you learn that, then you can go up. Well, I need the double reed. Yeah, you need the double yeah, reed. Yeah, I need one. So, so, so point me out one. Uh -huh. right. You don't want that basin off the water right now. Okay. Yeah. You want to hit that because it bounces off that water and just uh -huh. it'll, it'll, echoes around. Yeah, and yeah. it'll just flare them up out of there. Right. It's kind of like turning your siren on at the fire uh, department. That's it. They're gone. They're gone. Yeah. Now in the timber, you can you can get that base going and get uh -huh. that, what we call that pop. Right. And then get that bark. Uh -huh. Some people call it pop. Some people call it bark. Uh, yeah. Be good in the, yeah, in the, in the timber. Yeah. And so basically, when you're finding your hands, uh -huh. control. Say the word quit, 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 right quick, set the pitch. Just quit, quit, quit. Yeah, just say, just go quit one time. I was just doing the. That, that's the thing. That's good. It, no, it ain't good. Yeah, that's good. Quit. Say the word quit. Correct. The one you heard me calling today uh -huh. was that. Yeah, this one right here. Yeah, it's double, double reed. Yeah. I got yeah. you. Because it's on open water. Uh huh. Right. Shoot, I'm gonna do it. Let me let me get that one. I'm oh, gonna no, try no. my best. Well, I'll put that black one in there. That'll work right there. Look, I already got me a band. Already got him. Already a band. got me a band implemented right there. I make Rusty jealous. You wanna get a picture? Can you get a picture with Doctor Duck? You Where's Kenny? Where did he go? We're gonna make What's up, Come man? on. Three, four, three. Pitch, you got everything you need? I've got my duck hunter starter kit. Dennis says he's gonna teach me how to call, so we're in the chips tomorrow. We're about to get hit by a car, too. <laughs> Pitch, you ready? Yes, sir. I am ready to get after it. You got your duck call? I don't call? know what I'm doing, but I'm ready. Are you serious? He is bandit. <laughs> oh, yes, he is. <laughs> he got a band on. Get him. Get him. Get him. <laughs> Axel, here. Little bling bling. That was a good shot, too. That was only one shot, one kill. Yeah. Heck yeah. Little bling bling. Hey, look how wore out it is, too. It's been on there for a while. See it? That is crazy. We just said, what's this bling? The only time he pulls the trigger all this whole trip. Huh? The only time he pulled the trigger this whole trip. <laughs> it is the only time, yeah. isn't it? That's the first time of him, yeah. Alright, we found him. We, we wrapped things up here in Louisiana and had a great time here the last couple of days with our real tree family. So uh, we're gonna try to hit the road, try to head back up north, get some scouting done, get back on back on some public ground and uh, get back after it. But we definitely had a great time here. Had an opportunity to hunt with a bunch of group of young men today and uh, it was a great time and looking forward to doing it again one day. Not every day you get to stand in the trees and pick out a banded speckle belly. You know, that was right? awesome. <laughs> that was awesome. Uh, well, man, I do appreciate the invite. Yes, sir. You have an awesome place. And, and thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, sir. 15 seconds of fame. All the miles trying to feel this addiction for a few simple seconds of glory. But don't you ever forget, my friend, to enjoy the journey.